Day four, headed back to the house, had to drop my daughter off at the school so she could get on the bus and go to a volleyball tournament this morning, which I'm gonna meet up with her here in a little bit. But for now, I am headed back to the house to throw some ice in the cold plunge, get it cooled down. Temperature was 61 overnight, so I'll be interested to see what the temperature of the water is at. It takes so much ice to get the freaking cold plunge down below 55. All right, let's get the temp pre-ice. It's probably gonna be 60, 63, 64. Okay, about 64 degrees though. You gotta get that down about 10 degrees. Made some bigger ice blocks, see how that goes. The ice has been in here for probably 15, 20 minutes. I came out earlier and I barely got it below 60. But we are at it and dropping a little bit. So not the coldest, but still under 60 degrees. And the temperature overnight is prohibiting it from being too cold. But I'm not gonna go buy ice. So let's get in and do it. Set timer for two and a half minutes. It still feels cold. <sighs> got ice, got ice in here. It feels a little bit colder than I guess it would without the ice in here, if that makes sense. Kind of keep this next to me, try to keep my body colder. You wanna come over and say hi? This is my youngest son, Maddox. Hi. And he's done a cold plunge. Once, well, three times. Yeah. In the same day. But what about when we went in the ocean on the Oregon coast? That was kind of like a cold plunge because it was freezing cold. Day four in the books. See you tomorrow. We got day six of cold plunging. Let's go check the temperature. I need to clean it too, but we'll clean it after this one. So we're at 61 right now. The water actually has soot in it and bugs. I left it open overnight and there's a bunch of stuff has blown in there. We have a big fire just north of us. So it's actually probably a little ash in there too. On second thought, I'm gonna drain it and clean it out. There's a lot of smoke out in the air right now. Feels like it should be a little worse today. We decided to just clean it out. So that's what we're doing right now. Water was too nasty. There was too much stuff in it. But so that's kind of like the downside of having one of these. While they're very inexpensive and they're easy to manage and they're portable and all that stuff and it doesn't take up a lot of space you do have to clean the water out every once in a while but we have some natural stuff that you put in here to keep it clean and i'm going to try putting some of that in there maybe every couple days see if i can keep the water in there longer we've already had breakfast we've already had pan pancake sunday and now two of my kiddos who are up are going to do the cold punch with me well, he's young. i think you are definitely the youngest when did you wake up this morning like six and who's been entertaining you since 6 a.m this morning you. I wanted to check the temperature because the water is coming from a well, so I'm assuming the temperature of the water is going to be a little bit lower. 56, yeah, so 50, 57, which is great. So we don't have to bring it down from 60 or 61 that it was this morning. All right, here we go. She does. What do I win? Did you win the satisfaction of doing a cold plunge. And okay, two and a half minutes, two minutes. Two minutes? Come on, <laughs> sit down. I'll lay down. Okay, breathe. Dad, I can't do dip, this. Dip, dip down even more. No, 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 I am about to get out. Oh, I do not. Breathe. I'm gonna cry. I don't like this. I'm getting out. Deep, no, deep. Okay, I bet you 10 bucks you can do 30 more seconds. Okay, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. Okay, breathe. Dad, I can't do this. I'm getting out. Okay, I bet you 10 bucks you can do 30 more seconds. Okay, I'll get you a Starbucks. Two more seconds. You got this. Oh my God. Deep breaths. Good job. I hate your stupid healthiness. How Wait. much longer do I have? 15 more seconds. Worth it for that delicious <laughs> Starbucks decaf coffee. <laughs> yeah, 15 more seconds. Three. No, I'll tell you where. Get out. Dad, it's been 15 seconds. I think it's about 45 seconds now. See, you can do more than you think you can. Good job. Hey, Dad, if right. we're staying there for two minutes, could I get like a cake pop? No cake pops. Mm -hmm. No, because that's not healthy for you. No, I want it with ice. You want it with ice. I'm okay, let's go get the ice. He thinks he's so cool with his cold plunges. He kind of is though, cause he can do them. Those are, those are hard. Don't try this at home, kids. Glad you didn't do it. Oh, heck no. Oh, that's really, really, really freaking cold. Oh yeah, that's a way cold. Oh my gosh. Okay, if I dunk my head, will you get me something from Starbucks? Just go. Good job. <laughs> Deep breaths. What did you I dunked himself. Hey, no, go back down. Go back down. Go back down. No. Hey. Oh, God, it's really cold. I understand. Oh, yeah, heck no. I did need a great cooler. You're doing a great job. My challenge is to go in there and stay for 15 seconds. 15 seconds. Okay, okay ready, set, go. There's a fire by you. You're warming up. Okay, arms in. Good job. I want to get out, Dad. 11. Good job. <laughs> See? Awesome job. Oh, God. 
Isn't it cold? Yeah, it's freezing cold. <laughs> he stayed, Kalen, he stays in there for like... No, we don't need to stay up for four minutes. So the study is one to two minute sessions, up to 11 minutes per week, gives you the most benefits. Anything longer doesn't necessarily benefit you much more. I want to see what it got down to. Okay. Assuming 53. You're in it, so. There you go. Awesome. So 51. Perfect. And then, if you want to challenge yourself even more, you kind of move around because basically your body's <laughs> making a warmth barrier Are or you trying sure to. About that? So, if you move around, you break Are that you barrier. To survive alone? Like, yeah. You've been in there for a while. No. <laughs> I'm going to have to put a strainer in here. All right. No way, bro. Day six in the books. 